to use truthiness. <laughs> Substantially without truthiness. <laughs> it's inspired tonight's The Last Word, and it is another quiz. Another oh. quiz. Ooh. We have three questions around the theme real so or good. imagined. Yeah, we have two teams, Marika and Omar. Oh, we're stuffed. James <laughs> and Rosie. I've tried to make them a little nice. We're the yeah. 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 OK. Um, and Marik? Yes. What was it that you wanted when we had the last quiz? No quizzes. No? Oh, <laughs> Next no. two quizzes. No, that's it. I can't remember. What did I say? A gin? <laughs> Oh, a buzzer! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Squeaky toes! We are turning into It's a Knockout, and I don't know if you're happy with that. Am We're I? all going to be... You're equal. Oh, okay. I'm Walk the P. Yeah, okay. You got it. You Quick quiz, the good quiz. Confirm. Did you hear that? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> this is the worst thing that's ever happened to me. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> These are very intelligent. Yeah. I know my quick. mates are going to scream. Like, it. It. It's all over Twitter. <laughs> what Come famous on. hoax of modernism included the line, the black swan of trespass? <laughs> yeah, we know it. Very good. Very good. Number two. Which author fabricated her autobiography, Forbidden Love? Oh. No, I don't know. You don't? Just you just want to squeeze, to squeeze the oh. chicken, didn't you? OK, here's a, here's a clue. It was an international bestseller in 2003, same year as James Phony Fry. Um, it involved a young woman who owned a unisex hairdressing salon in Jordan. Oh! oh. 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 Uh, oh uh, Malcolm Knox wrote yes. the story about her. her oh. No bonus point there. Um, c c c c c c c c begins with a K, her surname, Yes, it does. It? And ends with an I. Nora Curry. Curry. Norma, Norma Curry. Curry, yeah. Yes. Norma Curry, close enough. Nice. That's good. <laughs> um, I knew That's a very distasteful speaker. <laughs> I think that's a really good one. Oh, yeah, um, number three, final Helen one. Helen Demidenko. <laughs> <laughs> Have a reverse one. Who danced in a Ukrainian folk dress? No. Oh. Um, what oh. was the name of the autobiography faked in 1971 about an eccentric billionaire? <laughs> <laughs> So Howard Hughes yeah, is the it was billionaire. Howard Hughes's, it, um... And it was written by. Um, he lived in Ibiza, that bloke. Oh, I can't remember the title. Was... No, the bonus oh, point. I just know it was about Howard Hughes. I don't know who. I don't it, know was who. Definitely... it was the autobiography of Howard Hughes, yes. written by Clifford Irving. Mm. And for a bonus point, the name oh. of his follow up book A Million Little Pieces. <laughs> 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 or something similar. Yeah. <laughs> it's the hoax. Congratulations. Oh, um, no. You yeah. get to take a, a book. Oh. You get your pick, but we won't do it exactly now. We have, we have to, to read all I think he actually wants to keep the pig. Yeah. I want the pig. <laughs> I want the pig, yes. Yeah. But what happens with the oh, next one? Oh, and quiz? a bald chicken. My dog loves bald chicken. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds like a you for me. Oh, the wheels yeah. have fallen off the bookshelf. Really, <laughs> Ten years and you finally got what you wanted, Dan. Wow. Bald chicken. <laughs> Time to go and won't you join me in saying a warm thanks to tonight's <laughs> quarrelsome book club. Rosie, Jason, Marie and Omar. <laughs>